Hello Loomers! Already posted on my channel are these two bracelets for Halloween and now I'm adding this new fun one to the collection to make the spiders on the web bracelet. You'll need two colors of rubber bands, one for the spiders and one for the web and you'll need a C-clip to hold it together and a hook to construct your spiders. To make your web, you'll need about 12 rubber bands in whatever color you want it to be. And we're going to make this by hand. Take two rubber bands, place one on top of the other, fold the outside edge around and through the hole, and pull it straight to connect the two bands together. And then keep going until you have the length that is comfortable for you to wear. I like to wear my bracelets with six bands across. You may need it a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller. So we're gonna make two strands even in length. So here's my first strand and now I'm going to make a second one for the other side of the web the same way. Once you have your two strands for your web created, you want to take one end, stretch it, and place the C-clip across. And we're going to keep the other two sides open so that we can attach the spiders. So to make your spider, you take your hook. You can use a hook that came with your loom kit or a crochet hook. You're going to wrap your spider color band around the hook twice so that you see three loops on your hook. Then you're going to take two rubber bands for the spider's legs, pull them tight, and push that tripled over band to the center. Put your hook through two of the loops, like that. Catch one side of your web and tug it through those two legs. Then do the same for the other side. Put your hook through the two legs, catch the other side of the web, and pull it through. And now you've got your first spider on your bracelet. And I like my bracelets to have lots of spiders. So again, wrap my spider color band around twice so that there's three loops. Take two black bands, hold them tight, push that tripled over band to the center, then put my hook through two of the loops like that. Catch one side of my web and pull it through the spider legs and do the same with the other side. Now I've got two spiders ready to crawl around my wrist. And keep going until you have whatever number of spiders you would like on your bracelet. I'm guessing some of you who are Spider-Man fans might make this maybe with red and blue. That would be really cool to see. If you do that, post a picture for me to see. Either on Facebook, where anybody's welcome to post on my board, or on Instagram. You can find me at Kim Maycraft. I love to see your pictures there. Just make sure you tag me so that I can find it. And you can tag me on the photo itself. And this will be my last spider, the same way. Once you've got your last spider on, catch the two ends of your web, stretch them tight, and bring that C-clip around from the other side and hook them in. And then you can move where your spiders are. If you'd like them close together or spread out, they will travel. And I just like to make sure that the bodies are all pushed up to one side, and then they are ready to wear for Halloween or any other day you feel like it. <laughs> Who am I to say that it's only for Halloween? You can wear this any day you want. Well, I hope you had fun making spiders on a web with me today. If you did, the best way to thank me is to share this video with a friend. Give it a thumbs up below and of course subscribe.
so that you can be one of the first to know when I post additional videos. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to looming with you again soon. Bye bye!